Hi guys, welcome back to another episode of Under the Floodlights. Tonight, we are getting a first taste of European action as we head to Edinburgh to see Hart take on Lampion side RFS. And the Europa Conference League should be a cracking tie. Hearts need a win to keep their slim chances qualification alive. That could depend on a result that's coming up first, uh, where uh, Istanbul take on Fiorentina. Uh, Fiorentina win, Hearts are out. However, if they don't, Hearts can keep their hopes alive this evening. So, Hearts currently 7th, though, in the Scottish Premiership. Haven't won the last six in all competitions. It's going to be tough. They'll need a big performance, but they did win in the opening tie out in Latvia. Um, so there is a chance. They did finish third. Obviously, got into the Europa League, but went out the qualifiers to Zurich after a bit of a capitulation at home. Uh, a bit of facts about RFS. AFK Riga's football score is uh, from Riga. I'm just going to call them RFS because it's easier tonight. Formed in 1962, 2021 Latvian champions and the cup winners won the double. Uh, they have one game left in the league season, the 2022 season. They are three points behind, so Mass Matter can still win it. But they are, let me just check, 27 goal difference behind its leaders, uh, Valmira, Valmiera. So it doesn't look likely, so they'll be hoping to get a bit of pride back and uh, get their first win in the qualification. I'm just about to head to Edinburgh. I'll see you guys. That's us here on Haymarket, uh, ready to meet up with my good friend Max, who helped me sort out the tickets tonight, he's a Hearts fan, go for a little drink and then head towards the game. Um, as it stands right now, Istanbul are 1 0 up in Fiorentina, so Hearts are back this in the This is a customer information announcement. Unfortunately, uh, we're going to beat this time, so we're out. We're for a win here. Let's uh, see how we get on. Bye, Jambos.
race tracks. Two at the Jambos, half been full control, two great goals. Go at a nut fire first, but still expect Hearts to comfortably win this. Good second half early start, should be easy enough. A bit disappointing, it's a bit to play for after the sort of two result earlier, but I'll still put up a good performance and expect them to win. See you guys soon.
Hi guys, so that's us back home, back Glasgow, back from the capital. Um, so overall, yeah, I think it was a really good game. Hearts deserved winners. RFS really had a couple of chances and the goal really was out of nowhere. Um, thought Tony Sibic had an absolute storm in the game at the back, which is always good to see. Um, also thought Josh Ginelli, fucking great out wide. Um, Michael Smith, I think, could have done more to try and support him, but I know he is a bit... You know, of an elder statesman at heart, so he might not just have the pace to fully support that. Um, yeah, thought it was a good performance. Barry McKay did a good first half. Second half, he kind of zoomed out. Um, good atmosphere from the Hearts fans. Uh, we kind of up and down at some points, but that's to be expected after the disappointment of you know, the Fiorentina Istanbul result and Hearts really not having any to play for other than Pride. And the, I think it's half a million to get for the win in this competition, which will do a lot of good. Uh, so yeah, I had a good time, uh, quite a few RFF fans, maybe 40, 50, which I mean, it's still a really good return considering the arsehole it must be to get to Scotland from Latvia, I can't imagine there many direct flights. But uh, yeah, a good experience, I hope you enjoyed the video, please remember to like, subscribe, put that wee notification bell on and check all the links in the description. And I'll see you all in the next game on Saturday where we see Rangers take on Aberdeen.